Hey y'all, good morning. Today is Sunday, so I'm coming on here to start up a vlog, a new vlog. It's been a long time since I've done a vlog, but today I'm thinking I'm gonna do a Sunday reset vlog, just getting some things in order around my house. And I may get out for a split second, um, but I just wanted to bring you guys along. It's been a long time since I've seen y'all, so I just wanted to come on here and do a quick vlog for today. Um, I have my baby over there. He's jumping in his jumper. I'll put a clip in and show you him because we haven't seen you guys in a very long time. I think he was about a month or two when I last vlogged. So he's six months now and I'm trying to jump back into the swing of things. I'm getting the hang of this motherhood life a little bit. So I'm coming on here to do a reset vlog. But I'm starting off first with breakfast. It's, um, like nine in the morning so i'm about to make me some breakfast real quick um open up some blondes around here so hey y'all uh, i'm continuing let me put my music off i'm continuing my reset cleaning um just all over the place this vlog is kind of all over the place but it's just an update this is what my life is like now refrigerator but i'm cleaning up my kitchen now i just got through wiping down the front door i should have recorded it but that'd be my story of my life i'd be forgetting to record but i bought these little jars like this at ikea and i'm about to put some juice in it This is how those look. So I got orange juice in one. Simply lemonade in the other one. And they just come with these little cork tops. You put them on there like that. And they just look much more aesthetically pleasing in the refrigerator. So that is that. I'm doing that. And I'm going to clean off my counters and everything. And straighten up my kitchen a little bit. I said five in the morning. I wake up to five on my yard. Yeah, in my mind is a warning. Praise to the one you're relying. I've been wandering all day. Try to be fine, but I can't be. The noise in my mind wouldn't leave me. Try to get by, but I'm burning. That's a really good clean countertop. And these are new as well, y'all. I got these um, bar stools. And I'm so mad about them because I measured them and everything and they still are too tall. Like, I just knew I had the perfect size. But I think I was assuming that the whole bar stool was the height. Like, I don't know what I was thinking. Because it's too tall. But if y'all know any suggestions on how to shorten these, I'm thinking my husband and I are going to, like, cut the legs down. But they need to be shortened. They have to be shortened. But that's that. That's an update for the house. Um, other than that, I'm pretty sure we've gotten a lot of new things. It's been about six months. I just have not updated. Um, but this is what the counter looked like clean. And I'm about to go ahead and finish cleaning the rest of my kitchen. Getting it all cleaned up. still just cleaning up chilling around the house doing some well-needed house maintenance the baby is sleeping right now which I have been able to take a shower get dressed like Lord I feel like a new woman you know so I'm getting dressed and getting ready to move around the house clean up and stuff but I'm about to get ready to put on some perfume so today I'm gonna be using this floral marshmallow perfume by Dossier um, and these were sent to me by Dossier, but I wanted to try them out and give my honest opinion on camera about how I feel about these. 
and this particular one floor marshmallow it is inspired by Killian's love don't be shy um everyone had been raving about it since Rihanna said that was like her fragrance and I wanted to give it a try but I didn't want to spend the Killian price tag I think the perfume is about 250 so I have this one in this fragrance from Dossier it's only $39 y'all so it smells exactly like it like it smells like it now the lasting power i haven't gotten a chance to try that just yet when i tell y'all this smells exactly like love don't be shy um i have recently received a sample of it in the mail from sephora um they were kind of like pushing their fragrances for the springtime so they sent me like a booklet with all the different fragrance samples inside and this smells exactly like killian love don't be shy in the notes on here are marshmallow bergamot, orange blossom, honeysuckle, jasmine, orris, amber, vanilla, and musk. The base notes are amber, vanilla, and musk. And that's really what I smell. I smell the marshmallow. I smell the vanilla. It smells very sweet. And the marshmallow is like really strong in here. But as y'all can tell, let me say, let me show y'all something that I discovered the other day. So this one has marshmallow. Barclarot um, 540. I don't actually own the original fragrance, but I did buy this Ariana Grande's Cloud because everyone was saying this smells like that. It has marshmallow in it. Um, from Dossier, I ended up getting the Ambery Saffron as my other pick. And this is inspired by Baccarat Rouge. It has marshmallow in it, but I really like these fragrances because they smell very, very light. Now, the original Baccarat, I haven't gotten a chance to smell that one. Hopefully, for the price tag, it has a like a longer lasting, um, what is it called? A longer lasting um, smell, but these are very light, but they smell pretty identical. So, I'm assuming they're right up in the family. They're getting it. They're getting it right somewhere, um, but also my Killian's um, princess has marshmallow in it. So I'm like, I obviously got a marshmallow thing that I didn't know about. And then my other fragrance that I've been loving is my YSL Libre, the intense version. This is how this looks. Um, Y'all, this pretty much turned into a fragrance haul and I wasn't trying to, but I don't think this has marshmallow in it. But y'all, most of my fragrances up here has marshmallow in it. So that's what I have. I'm gonna get some more though, but not in excess. Like I don't want too many because I don't go anywhere. I work from home, but I do smell good from home. So that's this part of this video. Y'all check down below for my coupon code. I do have a coupon code in the description that you can use for Dossier to get some money off. And we love to save money. So that's that y'all. I'm about to get around here and finish with the laundry and um, I forgot what else was on my agenda today. Laundry. I had some other stuff to do, but I'll keep y'all posted and bring y'all along. So stay tuned for the rest of this vlog. Y'all, so our new stroller came in and I'm about to unbox it real quick. So I'm gonna share that part in the vlog as well. We got a Nuna Triv. And so I'm really excited to see how it looks and everything. So I'm about to unbox it right now. So we got two wheels. Oh, this is the um car seat car seat adapter. I'm not gonna be using this because I don't have a Nuna car seat. Um, some of y'all may know by the other videos we have a Duna car seat currently, and so I just went ahead and got this stroller because. Um, he, I want him to have something that he can walk around like the neighborhood in and not be in a car seat form. I'll probably buy a Nuna car seat if we have, you know, another child or something like that. So this is a, I guess, look, let's see. And then the stroller. I think 
that's it, y'all. This is kind of self-explanatory. So this is the stroller. This stroller is really easy to pick up too. I won't say it's just like extremely lightweight. It's not heavy, but it's not the lightest thing either. Um, um, so it should have four wheels, right? I'm only seeing two wheels. Uh, let's see. This is the rain cover. I know about this because I've watched a million one videos on it. So it comes with a car seat adapter and a rain cover. I'm not gonna be using either one of them right now. And I must be missing two more wheels. Let me find them. Alright. So we got two wheels, two wheels. Oh, we need the these are the back wheels. So how do they go on though? Okay, I'm missing something else. Move, Gooch, please. All right, so. Yeah, these are front wheels because they just pop in. Okay. No, this is the back of the stroller. I'm tripping. So these are the back wheels. Alright, so I found the other wheels. We got two more wheels for the front and they just pop on as well. the wheels are on now this is what we're working with feels really nice it feels a lot nicer than I honestly thought it was I thought it was gonna be a little bit more flimsy but it's not at all the stroller put together I'm about to try it out and see how it rolls and everything I have the Nuna Triv in the color Frost, so it's like the light gray color. Um, I think it's really pretty, and I, it was real easy to put together. Literally, all you had to do was pull all the parts out and pop the wheels on, and they just click into place. So it was really easy um, to put together. That's what it looks like. Real smooth. Let's take it for a roll around I'm just testing it out. You want to try your seat out? You want to try your new seat? So, we got a baby here to try out these new car seats. I mean, sorry, new stroller. All right, y'all. So, we got a baby in the seat now. I see why Nuna came out with the magnet um claps like this because this is a little bit much to try to do that but let's take them for a spin how you like your new swing Lenny, she going someplace where you gonna go we running over stuff Woo! it rolls really nice and i got the calf support thing bending down but you can push the buttons on the side and like hold it up like that. 
I'm trying to figure out that third C position is supposed to click into three positions. I just see two right now. I don't know if the third one is like the opposite way. All right, this is that. This is the Nuna Triv, and this is Duna right there. Let's compare them. Ooh, let's compare. You like this one better, mommy? I'm gonna park him. Boop, you parked. So that's the Nuna. The Nuna Triv right there. And this the Duna. So that's the difference. But that's this one. You like it, BB? You like it? So I like it a lot. Um, this is the shade. The shade covers up really good and it's extendable so you can unzip this and have even more shade like that and it has some mesh on the side where you can see him and he can breathe you got some shade in there <laughs> but yeah so this is the Nuna Triv right here if you guys are interested and I have the color frost it came in like a black or this light gray and I wanted to say it comes in a darker gray too. But um, I like this color. I think it's really pretty. And because we had the Duna in black, I want to get something a different color. So that's the baby's new stroller.